Hey DIYers, Jarrett with Alarm Grid here. Today we're going to be discussing how you would bypass the sensor in Total Connect 2.0. Now, when you are bypassing a sensor in Total Connect 2.0, uh, you're basically allowing the alarm system to ignore the signals that are coming from that sensor. Um, <clears throat> so, if the system is in an arm state, uh, armed away mode or arm stay mode, and that sensor were to be faulted, uh, the system is going to ignore any signals that are coming from that sensor. So, it is not going to set off the, the alarm. Now, uh, don't worry if you do have uh, any other sensors that are, are programmed into the system um, and they're not being bypassed, they will work normally as they would. Uh, so they will definitely set off the alarm as they're programmed to do. Now, if you were a business owner or a homeowner and you did have a sensor that is constantly uh, setting off false alarms or it's in a constant trouble condition um, <clears throat> or uh, you just don't have the time to be able to troubleshoot the sensor or whatnot and you do have to go, uh, you can bypass a sensor so that uh, you don't have to worry about it setting off a false alarm. Now, for this video, I do have a sensor programmed into Honey Lyric right now. Um, <clears throat> it is programmed as so uh, if you were a user and you did want to bypass a sensor in Total Connect 2.0, you'll follow uh, a couple of different steps. So I do want to add real quick before we jump into that, uh, that <clears throat> you it, there are certain sensors you cannot bypass in Total Connect 2.0. Um, you're not able to bypass uh, certain carbon monoxide detectors, uh, certain smoke or any smoke detectors, um, any life safety devices in general, you cannot bypass those. Uh, but like normal door window contacts, motion detectors, um, glass brick detectors, anything that deals with burglary uh, sensors, then you will be able to bypass those in Total Connect 2.0. So now that that is covered, uh, let's jump into how you're going to bypass the sensor in Total Connect. So first, you're going to log into Total Connect 2.0. And once you get to the, to the main menu, uh, you're going to look for the option called sensors. It's normally going to be in the little window where it's showing you if the system is armed or disarmed. Uh, you'll see the sensors option in there. So once you tap on that, it's going to pull up the different sensors for your system. Um, it does take a, a, you know, a minute or two for it to pull up, so just be a little patient with it. All right, so as you can see, all the sensors have pulled up in, in, in our Honeywell Lyric. Uh, so <clears throat> as I explained before, we do have a sensor programmed, a side door in the Honeywell Lyric right now. So I'm going to be uh, choosing side door. And on the bottom right, you're going to press bypass. And once uh, you have sent the bypass to that sensor, you are going to get this confirmation. Uh, <clears throat> and you're basically just going to press OK on it. And then uh, you're going to hit the back button on the top left. So once you go back, you're going to see uh, that it says disarmed bypass. Uh, it says armed away bypass and arm stay bypass. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, arm away our Honeywell Lyric. And we're going to test out the sensor to make sure that it has been successfully bypassed. So as you can see, the Honeywell Lyric has gone to an armed away mode, um, <clears throat> and it does say bypass. So I have the side door sensor in my hand right now. And as you can see, we have programmed it to ignore the signals that are coming from uh, the sensor. So now I'm going to disarm the system, and then uh, once I have disarmed the system, you will see that the um, bypass for the sensor has been cleared and it is going to start working again. So now the bypass has cleared. Uh, so if you did want to have to bypass the sensor again, you do have to go through uh, those steps to be able to bypass that sensor. 
And that is how you bypass the center in Total Connect 2.0. If you have any questions about Total Connect 2.0 or alarm systems in general, please contact us at support at alarmgrid.com or go to our website, alarmgrid.com. Uh, if you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe. And if you want notifications on future videos, please click the bell icon. This is Jarrett with Alarm Grid. You have yourself a great day.